the Supreme Court has said activist Gautam Navlakha, who was arrested in the Elda Parishad case of Bhima Koregao, cannot get a statutory bail as his 34-day house arrest period will not count as custody under the CRPC provisions. House arrest of the appellant was not purported to be under Section 167, said the two-judge Supreme Court bench on Friday. Supreme Court also laid down the law that house arrest can be considered part of custody remand period needed to calculate total time spent by an accused in custody. But this declaration will not help Navlakha as the court held that in the facts of his case, the HC orders of house arrest did not make it clear that the house arrest was in place of the custodial remand. The Supreme Court had last week dismissed Gautam Navlakha's plea seeking bail in the Elda Parishad case. The court examined the technical grounds raised by Navlakha for the default bail as the charge sheet in the case was not filed by the NIA within the stipulated period of 90 days, which also includes 34 days of his house arrest. The activist had challenged the Bombay High Court order denying him bail on the same grounds. The concept of house arrest as part of custody under Section 167 has not engaged the courts including this court. However, when the issue has come into focus, and noticing its ingredients we have formed the view that it involves custody which falls under Section 167, said the Supreme Court bench. It further added, we observe that under Section 167 in appropriate cases it will be open to courts to order house arrest. As to its employment, without being exhaustive, we may indicate criteria like age, health condition and the antecedents of the accused, the nature of the crime, the need for other forms of custody and the ability to enforce the terms of the house arrest. The Supreme Court has also noted that the order passed by the Delhi Court allowing transit remand for Navlakha was bad in law. It has noted further that illegality in order of the CMM, Saket, will not erase the deprivation of liberty. But the court has also held that the house arrest ordered by the Delhi HC was not within the purview of Section 167. The fur against him was re-registered in January 2020, and Navlakha had surrendered before the NIA on April 14, last year.